Hey, sweet friends. In our Scholastic this week, we are talking about water and swimming pool safety. If you want to, you can get out your Scholastic paper and we can go over some of these things together. In the middle of our Scholastic paper, it says, is it safe? Give a thumbs up to show what is safe and a thumbs down to show what is not safe. So we're gonna look at every picture and I want you to give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you think it is safe or not safe. Number one, is it safe to swim with a grown-up? Let me know guys, is it safe to swim with a grown-up? Yes, thumbs up. Good job, guys. It's very safe. We should always swim with a grown-up. Let's look at number two. Is it safe to walk carefully by the pool? Is it safe to walk carefully by the pool? Or is it safe to run by the pool? It's not safe to run by the pool. So, is it safe to walk carefully by the pool? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Yes, guys, good job, thumbs up. We should always walk around the pool. It's very slippery and you could fall down and hurt yourself if you run around the pool. Let's look at number three. Is it safe to run by the pool? We just talked about that over here. Is it safe for you to run around the pool? Thumbs up or thumbs down? No, it is not safe to run around the pool. We talked about how it could be very slippery. We do not need to run around the pool. Let's look down here. Is it safe to wear a life jacket in a boat? Should you wear a life jacket when you're in a boat? Yes, you should wear a life jacket. That is a thumbs up. You should always wear a life jacket when you are in a boat. Let's look at number five. Is it safe to listen to the lifeguard? This is the lifeguard. She's working to help you stay safe while you're at the swimming pool. Should you listen to her? Thumbs up or thumbs down? Yes, we should listen to her. She helps protect us while we are swimming. We should always listen to the lifeguard. If she tells us to get out of the water, we need to hurry up and get out of the water. She is in charge at the swimming pool whenever you are swimming. That is a thumbs up. Let's look right here at Clifford's big idea. Jack is excited to go swimming but there is no grown-up around. What should Jack do? Think about that for a second. Hmm, what should Jack do if he really wants to go swimming, but there is no grown-up around? Did you say he should wait for a grown-up to be there? That is the correct answer. It's very important to wait for a grown-up to be there so that they can keep you safe while you are in the water. Now, the way a grown-up keeps you safe is if you start going under and you need some help, there will be someone there that can help you. So you should always swim with a grown-up and always be careful and safe when you are around swimming pools. Thanks, guys. Talk to you soon.